Daddy. Yeah, Bone Daddy. Yeah. <laughs> what do you say about Bone, bone Daddy? daddy. <laughs> be looking for Bone Daddy bone tonight. Daddy. I heard he was going to be on the loose. <laughs> Yeah, all right, Marty, I got your message this morning. I know you're all watching. Alan, good morning. How are you? Good morning. I'm great. Yeah, all right. Pronounce your last name. Ostrisky. Ostrisky. You're That's the right. only one in the phone book here, ain't you? That's right. And, 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 and Dusty hired me, too, so you can easy. That's right. That's right. And out all Mr. Nations. Simple, you know all these guys. So we'll give you a question. All, all right, tonight the weather, bad weather has passed us, so what's yes. the deal on tonight at Lindsay Lane? Yeah, tonight we were, it gave us a little bit of concern at the beginning of the week, um, but we have our Light the Night event, um, which is the same format as our Trunk or Tree, just a little different name, and we, uh, um, same, same type deal. We're going to be having 1,000 hot dogs and uh, drinks and uh, we've got 40 plus trunks that are going to be there chock full of candy. Oh, okay. We've got games, inflatables. It's just going to be a great time. So we're yep. expecting a couple, even 3,000 people. Last year, didn't we have to postpone it? Or did we, 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 we had to cancel. Can. We had to That's cancel right. last yeah, week. Now, we, do, we did have a weather date um, this year. We kind of learned from that, and we had a weather date for tomorrow. Um, but it looks like all that weather's going to pass, so everything's, everything's good to go. Didn't you tell me there were 3,000? 3, 3,000. Yeah. We, we have a registration table, and... They said approximately 3,000 came through last year. That's right. It was packed. Well, and you know, everybody, everybody wears their Halloween costume, and one, one time a year, they, they, they get it on, they, they go out and have a good time one night a year. Well, this is an opportunity, but with it being tonight, um, the 29th, we're, we're able to... This is a free to event to anybody. It is. Free event. It absolutely is. What time does it begin? Uh, which starts... Uh, let's see, it starts at 6 o'clock. It'll be open to the public at 6 o'clock, and we go through 8. In the parking lot on the, the front of the church? Yes, it'll be on the southernmost side of the church. You can't miss um, it. You'll, you'll come in the northernmost side. We'll have one, one entrance, one exit, um, and so you'll come in um, come in the northernmost side, and they'll, you'll, there'll be people directing traffic. Or you people that live nearby can <laughs> take the sidewalk from yeah. anywhere, <laughs> anywhere <laughs> in Athens. You can take the sidewalk That's exactly there. right. <laughs> Get out and walk to the... Walk to the trunk or treat, to the trunk or treat yeah, out with a bag full of candy. Yeah. All right, we'll Across get back to that in just one other second here. Mr. D, what is your subject for today? That's why we have these outstanding gentlemen up here to participate in it. Well, this is one that, that I know Dusty uh, will, will resonate with because of what he does. Um, just haters. People's opinion of you, right? And, mm -hmm. and you're always trying to figure out how to deal with it, what to do about it. And so I've come up with a, with a formula to just understand, and once you get this formula down, you'll never worry about what right. people Before think. Before we get into that, let's so talk about what you do. Oh. Anyone. This is a you have a blog, D Lauderdale. D Lauderdale dot com. Uh, the first podcast. I'm also doing a podcast, and the first episode was Jamie Cooper, and the second one was Dusty. And I was telling Dusty a few minutes ago, I got a, a, a text yesterday from a pastor friend of mine who was listening to that interview while he was studying. Good. Hmm. And I thought, why would anybody listen to me while they're trying to study? But they did. They're and they listening to Dusty. Yeah. Well, you know, that's right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's, you know, why did I not think about it? So you get that. And but he's also actually, written this short book here. I don't have a copy of yours up here, Dusty. I think I gave mine away. We anyway. let Dan, uh, Donnie Huddleston borrow Yeah, right here. Huddleston up in... Alaska. Alaska. It was minus yesterday up Ian there. Wanted to read he it. just wanted to make sure we knew the LSU game was going to be at 7 o'clock at night. And yeah, I know it. He wouldn't buy one, so I had to let him borrow mine. Okay. <laughs> this is about people that hate us. No, we it's hate just, them. It's just you learning how to deal with people. Just right? people that just don't like you. Or just time. people in general. Once you learn these three things, you'll never worry about what people think Not about you again. I know you don't care anyway what people think let's, about let's, you. Let's start with number one. What is it? <laughs> A third of the people are going to love you no matter what you do. My parents died. <laughs> okay. You're the exception. That's the third. That's the third already. <laughs> so a third of the people don't like no matter what. They, they are. You so could, a third of the church is going to like the, these two dudes. Know, Bobby Iron God. They could, Dusty could get up there and say almost anything, and a third of the people are still going to like him. Okay. They just love Dusty. Okay. Got all right. Okay. All right. So that's the first third. Okay. So you don't have to worry about them at all. They're going to love you. At no least two what. thirds. We got a third. We got a third. Don't all get right. I might need y'all to don't <laughs> breathe in this thing. <laughs> Oh, so well, we got some more breath in here. I'm going to make sure. That's why I brought this big. I knew it'd be a lot of hot air up here this morning. All right. So that's the first third. The next third, they're going to hate you no matter what you do. No. I don't like you. There could be that many people out there watching. A third of y'all don't like me. No, it's yeah. the third that aren't third watching. A third that do, a third that don't. Huh? It's okay. the third that aren't watching. Oh, aren't watching. that don't like you, right? Well, maybe they can't pick me up. 
Well, I mean, you know, whatever you got to think. But it is. No matter what you do, there's going to be a third of the people that aren't going to like you no okay, matter what. Okay, so you got a third that do like you no matter what, a third that don't dislike you no matter what. Right. So that leaves a third. Right. And they don't care. I could have come up with that ghost conclusion. I mean, did, did you do a lot of study to come up with that? I mean, it's simple. It's simple. Oh. Well, the question is, how do we get the thirds that don't care to start like? We got a better you chance don't. of converting them as we do the third that don't like. You can't person? convert them. People make up their minds about you in like the first four or five minutes of meeting you, and it's really hard to ever change that opinion. Hmm. No. Yeah. Well, Dusty, you ain't never going to have a full church, are you? No, that's right. Never. Good. So you saying Working I could. On third. So, D, what you're telling me, <laughs> I keep could. The third I'm good. telling you. I could have come across as maybe arrogant or something to some people at some time in my life. I Imagine have heard that. that. Well, I don't think that, but I have heard that. <laughs> I'm nice to you because your mom and daddy, they go to church with me. And your mom's a good cook. Yes, she is. Yeah, Amen. Oh no, actually, the, the whole reason I did this is just to say, quit worrying what people think about you. Yeah. It's not important because a third are going to love you, a third are going to hate you, and a third don't care. So yeah. just quit worrying about it and do what you do I learned and that. do it well. That's right. I learned that a long time ago because it'll make you gray-headed. No. If you worry about it. I don't say gray. I say white-headed. What happened to me? I say white-headed. I say white. We take it from Jesus. Jesus didn't, didn't command a complete following. It wasn't, everybody didn't follow him either. And so you have to right. be devoted to the Lord and be answerable to him and accountable to him first. And then that's let God. Matters. And that's why I made it that simple. Was really the whole point of the thing was not the thirds, but it was just quit worrying about what people think about you. Because well, you can't quit, change your mind no matter what. He did that a long time ago. I'm sorry? He did that a long time ago. Well, yeah, clearly. He obviously don't care. Well, the main about thing what? is we serve an audience of one. That's right. There you go. So you worry about what he thinks and then right. let the chips fall. Yeah, and just let it go. Well, let me get a football question in here. Did you, were you <laughs> upset last course. night that we came number four? I, I think wasn't we upset. Good... I was just kind of, you know, wondered, kind of confused, I guess the word, because, you know, six... I just didn't understand that. <laughs> We're in good shot, too. Those people got to get beat. That's right. Well, if you want to know the real polls, ask the bookies. <laughs> <laughs> I guarantee you. That's if the Alabama smartest was thing that's playing been said on this show today. Favorite. Alabama's still the favorite 6-1 to one in Las Vegas to win the yeah. whole thing. So that's, All right, trunk or treat tonight at yeah. 6. <laughs> that's right. Lindsey Lane. And Miss Sheila's actually cooking her hot dogs, too. So there you go. Get some of that. See, you got an awesome yeah. cook See, we, we kind of classified this as Lindsey Lane South. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. Well, you know, we have a few members in here kind of air on a daily basis now. Kind of a church plant down here, right? Yeah. They know how to take care of us. They know hey, we need to get You got a big uh, <laughs> ministry. You got a big baptism going on sure uh, Sunday do. morning, don't you? Big yeah. baptism. Uh, Miss Abby is going to be baptized. Looking forward to that. Oh, yeah? I really am. Right. Proud of her. Very proud of her. <laughs> Anything else we need to go going on out Lindsay Lane? Well, I'm starting to, I'm in a series, you know, John, Life and Times of Jesus, but I'm going to deviate the next three weeks and I'm going to preach on heaven because we're going to show the Billy Graham video on the 16th. I want everybody to bring your friends, lost friends specifically, and come and watch this great man of God video. It's going to be a Bring Your Friend Day on the 16th of November. So leading up to that next two weeks, I'm going to be preaching on heaven. Now, Billy Graham is, what is he, 90? 98. Six. I'm sorry, 96. 96. Soon to be 97. Wow. They did a thing on Ernest Ainsley the other day. He's still alive. He's still alive. Yeah. Yeah. That's what, white suit on. And not, and not doing well either. Uh, uh, Ernest, reputation Ernest is, is suffering from uh, uh, Ernest, Ernest, Ernest has got some skeletons. Yeah, yeah, yeah he does have skeletons. Come on, don't don't we all. Don't we all. All right, we're going to take a break for the day. Thank y'all for getting up with us. Y'all show up tonight down at Trunk or Treat in Lindsay Lane Baptist Church. Sing it, Maddie. <laughs> Yeah. And we'll see y'all tomorrow. You heard the choir. <laughs> <laughs>